Also, the federal government has ruled out the medium-term national development plan 2022 to 2025 and NIDRA Agenda 2050 to replace the outgoing plans, respectively. The Minister of State's Budget and National Planning discussed this at the opening ceremony of the Capacity Building Program for Special Assistance of Ministers of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and Monday in Abuja. Malik Kuduro reports. The Minister of State, Budget and National Planning, Clem Ikanade Agba, on Monday said the plan is anchored on the government's desire to address the prevalence of poverty by lifting 100 million Nigerians out of poverty in 10 years. He noted that good planning comes with implementation objectives in order to ensure constant check on the progresses made in different sectors. The plans are anchored on the government's desire to address the prevalence of poverty by lifting the 100 million Nigerians out of poverty in 10 years. It will also put in place strategies to tackle Nigeria's increasing population growth rate. Given that our current growth rate, the country will hit 411 million mark and become the third most populous country in the world by the year 2050. The key MDAs have established the performance metrics to track and measure the presidential delivery rules 2019 to 2023 to ensure improved service delivery. By the strength of this, government resources are now allocated in accordance with government priorities by linking this up with development plans. Also speaking, the program manager Conrad Adenio Stiftung. Samson Adeniro said the capacity building program is for the participants to be impacted with skills. Online from the resource person in Canada who was connecting and everything went very well without any issue. So it was very successful. And based on the sources of last year, we started uh, in this year to do it. And as the minister mentioned this story, I can assure you on behalf of uh, the country of and the foundation that the foundation will be very ready to continue with this training. It is hoped that this program will impact greatly on the input into the implementation of the national plans for the benefit of Nigeria.